a very good morning to all my students today we are back with our science class and we will be studying about feathers of birds so students you must have seen birds flying in the sky you must have seen different kinds of birds in the zoo so you must have seen no they are so colorful feathers that adds beauty to the birds so today we will study about feathers all birds have feathers they have different colors of feathers which add beauty to it you must have seen the feather of a peacock you have seen it no it's so beautiful so likewise all different kinds of birds they have different colors of feathers birds are the only animals that have feathers it helps them to keep their body warm it helps them to fly in the sky it even helps them to hide from enemies so we will study about different types of feathers clear now before we start to know about different types of feathers we'll first understand whether feather and wings are same no students feathers are fluffy structures attached to wings they are made up of keratins whereas wings are modified for limbs for flight made up of bones and muscles so actually feathers are attached to wings and wings are made up of bones and muscles so feathers and wings are different clear so now we'll study about different types of feathers so we'll come to the first type that is flight feather can you see flight feather that i have drawn here now flight feather are long flat they are found on the wings and the tail okay you will see this kind of flight feathers on the wings and towards the tail okay you will see they are attached on the wings and on the tail they help the birds to fly clear that's why they are named as flight feathers now we'll come to the second feather that is down feathers these feathers are soft and fluffy okay these are very soft and fluffy they cover the bird's body and keep it warm so the function of this down feather is they help to keep the body of the bird warm okay and they are very soft and fluffy now we'll come to the third type of feather that is body feather now this feathers form a layer on the down feathers they cover the body of the bird and give it shape so this feather gives shape to the bird you can see that is these feathers are giving shape to the body of the feather so there are mainly three types of feathers that is flight feather down feather and body feather and they also have different functions also clear so we have studied about the types of feathers now we'll study about wings movement okay we'll study about wings movement the strong chest muscles of birds help them to move their wings okay so the strong chest muscles of the bird that help them to move their wings while flying a bird moves its wings upwards and downwards okay can you see the upwards and downwards movement of the wings the movement of the wings is of two types upstroke and downstroke clear when they are having up stroke it is called upwards direction and when they are having down stroke that means downward direction you must have seen no you must have noticed also so now what is up stroke when wings move upwards and backwards okay that means upwards meaning backwards the wings move movement that is this movement is called up stroke then what is down stroke when move when the wings move downwards or you may say forward the this type of movement is called downstroke so there are actually two 
movements that is upstroke that is upward movement downstroke that is forward movement clear so some birds like peacock hens fly only short distance they cannot fly long distance whereas some birds like pigeon parrot they fly long distance some birds like sparrow pigeons fly at low heights also some birds like eagles kites fly high in the sky you must have seen no tiny bird in the sky up in the high they are flying but they are not tiny actually they are high, flying up very high the reason why they look very tiny okay so they are are different birds and they fly differently clear students 